I'm Wole, and you're listening to Fox Sports Radio 96.9 FM and 1340 AM, Hopewell, Virginia's Washington Redskins postgame show. The Washington Redskins fell to the New England Patriots 33-7, but the Skins started off fast, man. They started off right. Steven Sims Jr. had a 65-yard touchdown run to give the Washington Redskins a 7-0 lead. I mean, 7-0 on the New England Patriots? Did you really think that the Skins would have a lead against the Patriots? I didn't. But what happened? In that first half also, I mean, they held the Patriots down, scoring only 12 points, and they were only down 12-7 in the first half. Going into halftime, you would have thought, you know what? This team is looking okay. They can compete in this game. It didn't end that way. This Patriots scored 21 unanswered points in the second half. Tom Brady threw for three touchdowns to 348 yards, and they couldn't stop it. They couldn't stop, they couldn't stop a damn thing. Jonathan Allen, Ryan Kerrigan were frustrated. It's tough because like I feel like we come out of locker room and like we come in the locker room for a half time, we're excited. Like we're, we're like, all right, like let's go, like we're playing well, like let's do it for 30 more minutes. Like and then I I don't, I don't necessarily think it's a mentality. I just feel like we just, uh, you know, I haven't executed well. I feel like we just, you know, it's just little things each play that, you know, they ultimately add up to them getting in the field. So. You said you've been preaching all weekend, you know, the pressure. You guys got to it four times. That, 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 that is a big loss as far as going in the right direction. I mean, that's how you can get sacks is good, but. Affecting the quarterback is almost more effective than getting sacks. You can force him to overthrow, get an interception. So, I mean, it's not all about sacks. It's just about playing good team defense. You've got to go back and look at the film at this point. What did you do different the second half came out? Like, like I said, it, it's hard for me to tell. I, I would have to watch the film before I could say that. Realize you got to watch the film, but how frustrating is it that it's, it's different things, seem to be different things each week that, that are costing you. Anytime you lose, it's frustrating. It doesn't matter if you lose by one point or 1,000 points, it's still a loss and it's frustrating. So, same as it was the last four weeks. You even have Hall of Famer Adrian Peterson questioning what needs to be done. Coaches, players. You've been this league a long time. When, when you get to this point, say this season, you're 0 5. Do you expect or wonder if you're going to see big changes, whether it's coaching changes, whether that's you know, younger players getting chances? Do you, do you expect or wonder if those things are going to happen here? You know, I don't know, you know, to be honest with you, because I've never been in this position before, so I don't know how to respond or, you know. But it's clear that something has to change. That's one thing you do know, because we are 0-5. We haven't won. We haven't been productive as an offense. We show players, you know, what we can do, but we haven't been consistent in that. So, so okay, you go that to the job, or it's okay. That's good. It's coaching staff. Offensive and defensive, you say, okay, what what can we do better to put our players in better position to, to be productive in the offense, you know, to be better as a defense. It's their job to do that. We own five, so what we've been doing obviously isn't working. Penalties, yeah, penalties kill drives, you know. Um, but I, I feel like we, we can help ourselves in, in a way as well. Here's the question. Will Jay Gruden be the head coach for the Washington Redskins when they take on the Miami Dolphins next Sunday? Because at the end of the day, Jay Gruden went with his guy Colt McCoy and he only threw for 119 yards and his quarterback rating was 60.4. That's not cutting it. Because he could have went with the rookie Dwayne Haskins who probably could have done a little better. But only time will tell. But you've been listening to Wole of all skins, everything with the urban sports scene and part of Fox Sports Radio, 96.9 FM and 1340 AM, Hopewell, Virginia, for ages. You dig? Deuces.